All right, guys, Shotty T here. We got another video. It is day four versus our favorite day of the week, of course. But there's a little extra that's going to be with day four moving forward. So let's talk about it. So there was another update after this morning's update. And it talks about Wish Hero Recruit Launch Notification. Now, again, this may or may not apply to you. I'm guessing this is probably for people that are about to start season two. But if it's for everybody, that'll be awesome. But it says here, to provide you with a better Recruit Heroes experience, we will add the Wish Hero Recruit feature from server time 9-11 2024 so basically a week from today after that feature is launched in the recruit heroes interface every 200 draws will give you a free chance to get any specified hero in that pool please note that the number of draws you wish to use before will not count towards the wish uh, recruit count so we suggest you save your legendary recruitment tickets and wait for the feature to be launched before recruiting so, um, now I don't have a wish list, but let's say you want to get Stepman because right now the only way you can get Stepman is in, in the store. Um, it sounds like the wish list is exclusive to all champs in the game because otherwise it's kind of pointless to have a wish list for the champs that are only in the recruit store to begin with so um so as you can rec recall you have carly dva swift tesla kimberly murphy and marshall as the legendary champs that are in this particular ticket pool so the wish list it sounds like you get 200 for every 200 tickets now, we already have it where for every 50 tickets, you get a guaranteed legendary hero. But now it's saying if you get 200 tickets, then for every 200 tickets, you'll get whatever champ that you put on your wish list, you automatically get them. And all you need is one version of them. Let's say you get Stepman. I mean, that means you automatically get him. And then you can just use your legendary shards from there to just upgrade him to two three stars like if you can give him the four stars that'll be great uh cause let's look at his abilities when you unlock more stars so so if you get him the four stars heck if you get him the two stars he's pretty powerful because you get that extra lightning ball when he has his skill damage but obviously getting him three stars there's more damage and then but that fourth star add that second ball so you definitely want to, if you're able to, and I, again, I'm. this is just me speculating. I'm definitely, when this gets revisited next week, definitely going to look into that. Now, I'll have enough tickets um, at least to have 200, even if I use all my tickets today, which I am, because we're trying to win our versus matchup. We're trying to shut out the opponent for the week. Uh, if we win today, we win the week. doesn't matter what they do tomorrow or of day five or day six so we're we're playing to win today all right so and i'll have enough tickets but let's go ahead and do what we normally do it's going to open up all these tickets here and we're going to use um like there was one day that was pretty close this week but the rest of the days we've been in pretty good control but that day two uh, when they put us on notice in day two that had us take this matchup just a little bit more serious but i think i think they realized that we're just a little too powerful for them and on paper we are more powerful than them so they but they fought really hard it's a very top heavy alliance when it comes to productivity because i think they have all the top scores for the week so i'm gonna check I'm gonna show that standings real quick just to see so but um but yeah, I always like to open all the tickets first before I get to the shards. But we're going to wait till later to use all the other shards. But let's look at the standings. Let's open these boxes real quick. So for the week, uh, they have three out of the top four people. 
Like I'm only number 18 for the weekend. We been winning all week. Now normally, normally I take over everything after day four when I kind of shoot up to the top of the list because I do have some experience points to use. Um, so when we get to that time of the day where this arms race, when we get to the hero advancement tomorrow morning, we're gonna be taking all my air, all the remaining aircraft team members, uh, Lucius, Carly, um, Morrison, and De and um, Shiler. We're gonna take them all to level 150, and depending on how much we have left over, uh, we'll we might take another uh, five star champ to 150. So, so we'll definitely we'll 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 have 30, 40 million points before the day is over. So we got. Three, we got four million right now. It'll be times ten that amount by the time the day is over. So we'll see where I stand individually in the standings uh, compared to across both alliances. But yeah, so that's pretty exciting. The wish list is definitely something you want to um, save up your tickets for. If like if you're in a situation where you got a comfortable lead with the alliance that you're going up against or if it's if it's looking like it's a mismatch all week where you're probably destined to lose probably not a bad idea to just save the tickets for next week where you can get more bang for your buck uh with that wish list i wish they would add more new champs in the game now that would make the wish list more worth it um so that way you have people that's been they have very developed accounts have something else to look forward to or or they can add the they can add these uh exclusive weapon shards in the wish list now that would change the game but you know you know that's, that's too smart to do something like that you know it's too player friendly right they're not gonna we'll see i mean the game's been pretty fair for the most part being uh player friendly so we'll see if that's a possible update in the future but anyway, guys, uh, that'll do it for this video. Like, share, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and I'll talk to you later.